Oftentimes here at the Frog Project, we have students come to us with sore wrists. Maybe there's little bits of arthritis within the wrist joints, or maybe there's just a bit of overuse, or perhaps um, you're recovering from injuries and things like this. But often wrist aches are very present in our classes and community here at the Frog Project. My name is Carrie, and this short um, sequence of five different moves for the wrists is designed to help build strength in your wrist joints. So come onto your hands and your knees, and most of these postures or these exercises we can do from this nice kneeling place. So the first one we're going to do is to tent our fingers. So coming onto the fingertips and tent, make little tents with your hands. Squeeze your fingers in towards the floor and this is gonna have this strengthening impact on your wrists. So nice and steady with your gaze. Come to your breath, calm it down. And we'll just stay a few more nice long breaths drawing the energy up towards the center of the hands. Now, if you find this too strong, you can also always do one hand at a time. Breathe and then do the opposite side. Or you can hold for a few more breaths here. Good, and slowly release out of that. Take a break, give your hands a little bit of a shake or a roll if you need. And then the second exercise we're gonna do is finger taps. So again, from this tabletop pose, get yourselves nice and comfy, and then gently tap the fingers as fast as you can for up to a minute. So you can tap them like little raindrops here on the ground, keep tapping. Steady your gaze, steady your breath. Tap, 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 tap. Imagine like pitter pattering on the roof or on the windows. Good, let's keep going. Don't stop. Good, let's keep going for 10, nine, eight. Keep up the pace, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and one. And slowly, again, release. You can give yourself a little gentle squeeze or a little roll around. And then the third exercise are our wrist push-ups. So from tabletop here, we're going to spread the hands nice and wide and we're going to lift only the heel part of the hand. So light little push-ups for your wrists. So nice and steady. Sink your breath with the movements. Inhale, lift. Exhale, down. Inhale, lift. Exhale, down. Inhale, lift. Exhale, down. Keep going. And like with the first exercise, if it's too strong to do with both hands, you can always try one hand at a time as we gently build strength into the wrist. Let's do five more. Lift, lower down. Lift, lower down, lift, lower down, and last one, lift, good, and lower down, come back onto your seat and just give your wrists a moment to release, to relax. And then this is a nice one to do from sitting. So you can kneel, you can sit on your bottom, it doesn't matter. Interlock your fingers. We're gonna make figure of eight rolls with the wrists. So we'll do 10 in one direction. And then we'll swap and do 10 in the other direction. So three, two, and one, and reverse. 
might be a little more complicated on the other side. I find it more complicated. So keep going here. Nice for building a bit of motion, range of movement in the wrist. Three, two, and one. And slowly release. Now the last exercise is one that we can do to help loosen anything within the forearm that's causing tightness in the wrists. So you can do this by gently bringing your thumb just to massage down this center line here from the base of the wrist all the way up the arms and you'll notice if things feel a bit gristly in there, you can push. And if you can go a little bit deeper, lay one arm on the floor, forearm up, take the opposite elbow and lean into the forearm. Really nice little bit of self acupressure there, self shiatsu, self massage. You can do the opposite side. If it's too strong with the elbow, use the thumb or ask someone to do it for you. And there you have it. Five wrist exercises to help strengthen and support healthy wrist joints. If you wanna join me in a final relaxation here and a nice release for the wrists, you're most welcome. Child's pose, arms back behind you, backs of the wrists on the floor. You can make little fists with the hands and just massage the backs of the wrists into the floor and then let the hands relax. Good, stay here as long as you like. Whenever you're ready to come back then do. I hope you'd enjoyed this nice five wrist exercise sequence. Let me know if it was helpful to you. And if you wanna pop over to the Frog Project, you're very welcome. We have lots of live classes every week and lots of teachers on hand to give many more tips just like this one. So maybe we'll see you there. We do have a 15 day free trial, but if not, see you soon here. Bye bye.